Hey you guys, this is your girl Freedom. Uh, sorry about my um, usual setup. I really don't care right now. Um, I just finished working out with my trainer and um, she started a new pr program with me. It's called um, 100. Um, we start off uh, working out with her. I'm sorry y'all, I'm so thirsty. Mm. I'm sorry y'all really rarely see me do that. Um, so it's called uh, 100. I meet with her twice to three times a week. And we started off, we do 100 of each exercise. We switch it up. So um, we're doing it for three weeks. So the next time I see her, which is Wednesday, I'll be doing 200 of whatever. I really hate her right now. But I know it's for the better of my body. As you can see, look, I'm sweating. And my hands are still kind of shaky. Um, I've been doing push-ups and all that other stuff. Um, she is trying to get her website up. So she's taking pictures of me. And she's also taking pictures of me doing um, the exercise. So um, I'm also going to try to do snippets of um, me actually working out with her. Um, so you guys can see exactly what I'm doing. And then take it um, with your own plan or whatever. But you guys, I am so so tired and I hurt already um I didn't think I could do it because we did a hundred squats um we did a hundred push-ups I did a hundred leg raises a hundred um somewhat crunches you bring your knees your hands and your knees up and you do those and um a hundred um jumping jacks which I can't do the jumping jacks because of um, the hanging skin off my stomach so we do alternate where I stretch out my leg you know like you know you pull your leg out one you step in whatever um, so hopefully we'll have um, I'll have up because my friend who works out with me who is one of my brides to be um, if you saw my work you saw her engagement pictures of her and her husband her soon to be husband the ones of her with the cute background that is not a simulated background we went to Great Falls Virginia and I worked with a photographer to do that um, and those are untouched uh, pictures that's how good he is those are untouched pictures a lot of my work is untouched um, except for um, the one with the with the um, the music artist where it has her name at the top a lot of my stuff is untouched so anyway we're gonna do untouched videos um, somewhat of what I'm starting off to do but we don't want to really show I don't want to really show her program because if you live in the Maryland Virginia area or even out of state she does do boot camps out of certain states um, for a weekend or whatever so we don't want to really show her whole routine because this is something that she's trying to implement um, herself by really just starting out that way but um and I'm her test dummy which is not cool but I love you Veronica I love you mm -hmm, whatever my legs my butt my stomach especially my arms are hurting right now now I'll do a video tomorrow to show you how much pain I'm in and I am going to do water aerobics. Um, I don't care what it is. Hopefully it's not thunderstorming. I don't do that. Sorry. Um, but I will push myself no matter what, even if my hurting, just to go and get in the water. My head is spinning. I'm really, really, really proud of myself. Um, it usually takes someone 30 minutes to do everything. It took me over 30 minutes, almost an hour to do all of the hundred. Um, which she is proud of me. It was, no, it wasn't an hour. Yeah, almost an hour. I'm not going to lie. It was almost an hour. Um, and she was very proud of me and I was very proud of myself because I pushed through. Um, I really pushed through, um, which she wants to start, um, hopefully, you know, just doing the 100, the first part of the 100. Because like I said, we're going to beef it up to 100 every week until we get to the three weeks y'all I don't know if I can do it I was like can we do 75 and then you do 100 and then we do 100 and she says no so um 
I get no modifications, y'all. None whatsoever. Um, but modif modifications on the exercises, but no modification as far as the 100 program. You guys, I am so sweaty and I feel so nasty. So I am going to take a shower in a second as soon as I calm down and stop shaking because I'm afraid I'm going to fall in the bathtub. And that's not a good look for me. That's really, really a not good look for me. Um, this is the first time using my laptop camera. I have a lot of light, which I'm over at the same place that, um, the same place that I don't, you know, I do my regular videos, which is like, why do I have this laptop camera? Um, but anyway, um, I'm still drinking my shakes. I'm still in love with them. And to me, they're more like crystal light. Um, you still get your protein, but I wouldn't use it as a uh, meal replacement because it's like water and to me is it it's like water so um why even put yourself through that so um because it wouldn't fill me up but i don't know um a lot of you i've been getting emails um asking my opinion about the lap band surgery and i was talking to my trainer about it because she has a couple of people who are asking her um, who are trying to get surgeries different kind of surgeries um, not just the band but also bypass um, the reverse something the sleeve the reverse something I'm, I'm sorry if I'm messing it up um, and she wanted my spin on it and she's also um, recorded me talking about it and um, my opinion is you have to pick what's right for you but to be honest with you if you have to be honest with you if I'm putting in as much dedication that I am doing now far as my eating habits um, and what I can't really eat which if you put your mind to it is the same thing that you shouldn't be eating really so to answer that question I think if I really 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 applied myself as much as I'm applying myself now and the restrictions that I can have or can't have I might have not lost the 50 pounds but I think my body shape um, and my body percentage would have went down and my weight would have went down I'd at least lost close to 30 pounds I'll be honest with you working out with her I lost 20 pounds um, when I first was like 340 she got me down to 275 um, for my wedding so you know I did the no when I came to her I was 320 I, I want to take that back because I lost the so a majority of it myself and then um, she helped me tone the rest of it up and then I lost more inches and stuff like that anyway so um, I think if I really 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 would have done what um, I don't regret my decision to have this that's not what I'm saying and please don't get me wrong um, I'm not regretting anything I did um, but if I really think about it um, and a lot of you may be getting ready to say it's easier for me to talk because I have it and I lost the um, 50 pounds. Um, so I definitely understand where you're coming from um, on that because that's how I was feeling if you watch. A lot of you are watching the lap band videos but I need you to go back and watch me going through the process. How upset I was when I lost the first, I had my date and how frustrated and angry I was that I had to wait and it was a blessing in disguise because the surgeon that I have now thank you Jesus he is wonderful okay so um just to say that is just you know I am trying to do something else at the same time you guys and I'm sorry for this um but to say this is that you um it was a blessing in the skies to find him and to, um, sorry again, you know when you're working out you got that cotton now, and my, um, yeah I got that cotton mouth and my teeth sticking to my um, top lip, 
but um it was a blessing in disguise um and i even got some emails um about and i have one friend and i'm not talking about the one that sent the comment so girlfriend i'm not talking about you and it's a delightful experience to talk to you um but it's another friend that i met on youtube that um hasn't been on youtube for a minute and she's also had the surgery i think right after me and she's not doing so well as far as the weight loss and she's very upset about it and i'm trying to tell her that just because i lost what i lost doesn't mean you need to lose that and just like um bandit nika um told me when i had um basically uh did my i have seen video and was basically not doing what i'm supposed to do she told me quote unquote I'm, hopefully i'm getting this right girlfriend she told me that don't worry about it start with your next meal you may have fallen but the next meal not the next day not the next week she said the next meal i put in my mouth start help start to get back on track make that one very healthy um and that's what i did you guys and it's it's the same thing um and she's not doing too good and i'm i'm really trying to support her and let her know that we can do this together girlfriend um and she did admit to me and some and i kind of knew it she did admit to me that she ate what she wanted um that she wasn't really eating what she needed to she wasn't following up on her doctor's appointments with her seal um because of it wasn't her fault it was because some issues were going on um with her family not you know so she hmm. so she was you know basically going through it and stress can cause you to stop losing weight um and just like me she wasn't taking her vitamins I wasn't taking my vitamins. Bandanika was like, are you taking your vitamins? I was like, no. And you have to take your vitamins. Even if you're doing regular weight loss, you have to take your vitamins. Invest in B12 complex that you put under your tongue. Um, there is some um, B12, uh, just like the Listerine strips, that you can put under your tongue. It's just as good as getting the shot, but you have to do it every day. Um, and that's what I heard from my surgeon, not from per se or hearing from someone else I heard it straight from my surgeon's mouth um so that being said I hope you guys follow me in my new journey um well my still journey there's a lot of bumps in the road you guys um just like I had to be honest with you but her and I'm gonna be honest with you um what was it Friday I ate a fish fillet. I took the top half of the bread off, um, and because I can get some bread down, not too much of it, um, and I ate it with the tartar sauce. Yeah, I did it. Yes, I did. Um, it was sort of a treat myself. I didn't. My husband bought me fries and a milkshake. I totally put the milkshake away. Um, I'm gonna give it. You know, let my daughter have it or whatever or just take you know a couple of scoops of it or whatever but you know i treated myself to something um so you guys i'm running out of time i just want to say i love you guys thank you for the blessings and um like i always say if you look good smell good please y'all be a size healthy see y'all later bye bye